but what happens on the supply and demand curve if the price increases from $3, which was equilibrium price, to $4? In that case, there's disequilibrium and there's not equilibrium anymore. So what you have is a movement along both lines simultaneously. So from three to four, the supply will actually an increase in quantity supplied. So they're gonna make 40 instead of 30. And then for the demand, it's gonna be a decrease in quantity demanded going from 30 down to 20. So you've got this area where there's gonna be a surplus and that surplus is 40 minus 20, which is 20. So this is what your surplus is gonna be. And that's when the price has changed to $4 for whatever reason. It could be the company increased $4, something like that. And that's what will happen on that. Now, I do find most of the case in market day, like I was saying in class on a Thursday, I will see most of you way up here at a high price. And then you have a whole a lot of people don't want it. They're waiting till Friday. They're waiting until you lower the prices to go down. So typically I see this week equilibrium. It's very hard to get to equilibrium. I can say sometimes it might take six months to a year to get to the equilibrium price, people moving, going back and forth and so on like that. So the surplus at $4 is 20. And that's how you actually calculate it out and do that.